Principal Gada Sadaka's personal Facebook page went very public at the start of the school year. Her comments about Islam and refugees horrified parents. All the video that's attached to those posts have people spewing hatred. It just, it, it's, it's, it's completely illogical for a principal to do that in a public page. A mother and daughter spoke to CBC Toronto in October. I was mortified, I was scared, I was surprised that somebody would even say these things and still be a principal of a multicultural school. Their voices and pressure from the school community and beyond resonated at Queen's Park. CBC Toronto learned Ontario's Education Minister Mitzi Hunter met with J. Philip Parapoli, the director at York Region District School Board, today. After months of virtual silence, Parapoli posted his own message today, including an apology from Principal Sadaka. She wrote in part, upon further reflection, I accept that sharing the post was discriminatory and should not have occurred. Hi. From CBC. We requested an on-camera interview at the school board. Instead, we got this phone call. Beyond this statement, has there been any other actions taken when it comes to the principal? Like any sensitivity training? Well, again, you're asking me questions that, that uh, detail uh, personnel issues. I think what's important is that the principal has put out this statement. It, it seems like they've thrown the principal under the bus and, and done nothing at the board level. This Markham so father we, says the school board needs to regain parents' trust. They say that they did an investigation. We have no idea what they did. Nothing is public. We also have concerns that they didn't actually follow their internal policies when dealing with things like this. And so that sort of lack of transparency is what gives us no confidence in the board itself. Um, Shannon Martin, CBC News, Markham. Point, but with Director Parapoli on the board,